It is square. Oh, oh, okay. Damn, it's, it's me, bro. Shit, I was trying oh. to show you my God damn. Nah, bro, you know, that filthy. Was, that, that, man, huh? I didn't even porn bomb naughty. And I, I, I had the t fucking chance, technically. I didn't even porn bomb his ass. I ain't gonna porn bomb. I ain't never porn bomb nobody. I ain't not, nah, man. not once. Nah, man, you know, filthy clones people's accounts. So it, like, yeah, you're square, but hey, he'll come up here looking man, just like you. Yeah, that's what fuck I was saying. I wasn't saying you. I was saying somebody trying to pretend to be you, man. Yeah, fuck that fat motherfucker. Yeah, that motherfucker got high blood pressure. Nah, he got more than high blood pressure. What he got? He got Alzheimer's. He, he, he got Alzheimer's. He got old timers. That motherfucker can't remember what the fuck he did in the past couple of seconds. What up, Ruski? Yeah. Oh, we know Austin Powers is working, Burst. Look at there trying to stoke the division. Ain't he the dude who was taking the shit on you books? Yeah, I did. Uh, I did put him above my, my square one time, and I said, I'm taking the shit on you books. I sure did. I sung Cabby Chameleon. Hey, let's just water under the bridge, you know. You going to bring us some more old shit, bitch? You know that's Austin all they good for bringing up old shit. Austin Powers, the motherfucking. I know who you are, bitch. You're Caparo. That is Caparo. How do you know I that? bet a hundred dollars. I bet a hundred dollars. I just, I just know what, what. I just know the kind of types of fucking accounts he uses and the shit he does, and he ain't been able to get a rise out of me in a while. So he's fucking. He, he's he's on one. He uploaded a video earlier, and I was like, "That's so stupid." Hey, how does my audio sound to y'all? Do I sound like regular? Fine, you're good. Okay, cool. Yeah, Caparo. Caparo got hit upside hey, like the head with a, with a tire iron. What'd you say? I like the I like the Martin Luther King thing behind you there, books. Yeah, that's a book. That's one of my favorite books, To yeah. the Mountaintop by Rather Witherspoon. It's one of my favorite hey, books on you, Dr. Martin Luther King. You want to know something interesting? What? My my mentor that I would like to put you in contact with that has the organization for uh, only indigenous African descendants that, that uh, helps you. Like, I mean, <laughs> hey, for real, for real. Like, I can't even be technically an official member. But I grew up with a friend of his son, so he knows I ain't like I, I was over there all the time and saw him. This dude is a millionaire, and he uh he actually marched and knew Dr. Martin Luther King. That's amazing. He tried to he tried to get he said he tried to get Mr. Martin to take a uh a business approach instead of a social approach back in the sixties. Um mm. uh, because in in America, business is number one. And that was yeah. one of the things that not just Africans face challenge with, but even regular, uh, you know, we don't own our businesses. People don't own businesses no more. And that's where real wealth is. People ain't yeah. taught how to do that. They, they teach you to go to college and get a higher, uh, get a degree and you become a higher paid uh, wage slave, basically. Yeah, I agree with that wholeheartedly. I would I would say though that I appreciate the approach uh the good Dr. Martin Luther King took. I don't think it was more social. I believe it was more faith based. You know, we're gonna treat people how we want to be treated, how we want to treat others. He was a pastor. So I kind of like it that he didn't come in it about money or any other thing. I like it that he kind of brought, hey, what does God want us to do? How should we treat each other under the eyes of God? That's what it always kind of seemed like to me. Yeah, I, and that's I, I what know I appreciate that's it. About it. But, but but what I mean by him saying a social versus business is that instead of taking the approach to get others to change and make things better, he, he, he teaches people how to, uh, you know, build, build real wealth, you know, generational family wealth and stuff like that. He, he's a business guy. I see he's like saying. Robert Kiyosaki and all them others. Yeah. I see what you're saying. Instead of but hey, no. if some guys telling you to, uh, if some guys telling you to ride on the back of the bus, get your own fucking bus line type shit. I see what you're saying. 
instead of using they racist ass shit, let's create our own shit. I see what you're saying. Yeah, I get it. I didn't drop out in the 11th grade, smart ass. I dropped out in the 12th grade, you dumb fuck. And I didn't drop out because I wasn't fucking doing good in school. I dropped out because of the fucking social bullshit. Uh, real brother calls everybody a coon. I'm actually quite flattered. Uh, real brother actually was going to hold his show up just for me when I came on there because he hasn't seen me in a while. I appreciate real brother's commentary. Uh, we have a bit of back and forth because he's uh, what's that shit when you on that? You don't not believe in God, but you don't fully believe in God. What's that word? He's a uh, Gnostic. Yeah, he's agnostic. Agnostic. So sometimes we cross paths because he's agnostic. But other than that, you know, I agree with his politics and I agree with who he is as a man. So I don't have any any problems with real brother. I would consider him a mentor of mine of sorts. So. Well, you know, if you ever. uh... I mean, that that's one of the reasons um, faith in, in God and belief in God is, you know, I mean, that yeah. that's one of the reasons, like, you have to have that requirement to be a, um, to join a lot of uh, different uh, groups, especially one being uh, like the Masons, you have to, you have to have that. You gotta have that belief. You have to have that in your heart. Gnostic, agnostic. Uh, I mean, Gnosticism is another thing. I, I I didn't say I said Gnostic first, but then I said agnostic. Uh, is that I'm even right, really I'm mean? Right, right. What did you say? I don't know, whoever that Nina is. I, I'm beginning to think that Nina person has been in my chat all the time. It's been a mod is a fucking uh it's fucking worky verse. Because then I see Nina there and it's a whole different picture. Okay, agnostic. Yeah, I thought that's what we said. But I think they're just following you over. I here. did. I uh, said Gnostic yeah. first. Okay, well I mean shit. Agnostic, Gnostic. I, I knew what you were saying. You know, people are just trying to point out little shit. Because they think it's what funny. in the fucking problem is the what what the fuck is the problem in playing with your dog and having love for it? Like I just seen where you guys were making fun and playing that and everyone's like, Oh, what the fuck? Now, yeah, when you listen to it like that, that, that's why I did it. I knew I was gonna be, I was like, I'm gonna sit here and watch this and, and, and like I just got busy with Brownie and I was thinking, Man, they're gonna cut this uh, after I got started. I was like, shit, keep it going. Man, you motherfuckers don't you do not fucking um uh, what's the word disappoint you do not disappoint you always do what i think you're gonna do what's up Ruski? damn you got that fucking you got that uh flat top Ruski got that old flat top we got it a chili bowl Why are you smoking them disposable vapes, Ruski? Them disposable vapes are shit, man. <coughs> well, I guess they're all right when you're on the go, but I seen one day how they fit. Man, they, they fill them things full of, it's, it's got like a cotton thing in the bottom of it, and it, it's soaked in that cotton. You're, you're muted, Ruski. Said I'm smoking mushrooms. Mushrooms? You got two yeah. different vapes? That vape had yeah. a fucking. Uh, well, I have, I have another one at the house that I didn't open yet. So, yeah, I got one for tomorrow because I'm doing a. I got a special live coming up, Taco Tuesday, but at a different location, not my house. And I want both of you to, to be there. Yeah. You better buy some tacos. I mean, I could drop it right now. I'll tell you where I'll be at. <laughs> as long as it gets me views, I'm gonna go to fucking. Uh, I'm going to Hooters tomorrow. I'm gonna order some tacos from there. I'm gonna do my live, uh, live at talk, uh, Hooters and shit. So yeah. Hey, bro, yeah, I'm yeah. I'm to be there. Hamburgers and hot wings. They got tacos in that. They got tacos. They got fish tacos and shrimp tacos at Hooters. I'm gonna go. Uh, oh, I'm gonna have tacos Tuesday at Hooters. 
They got seafood yeah. tacos. They got the fancy tacos. Rooster, yeah. just go ahead and tell these people you hit the lottery or something, man. You're eating fancy <laughs> seafood tacos. You got your hair cut, man. You're smoking $100 vapes. You're giving me money like you, you like, damn, Rooster, tell these people you hit the lottery, man. No. Uh, yes. I don't talk about how much money I have. I just work hard and save money. That's it. Well, keep on doing good. I hope shit keep on going in your favor, bro. For real. And I hang out in the woods. Yeah, you are in the woods, huh? Yep, that do look like the woods. I hear a cicada. The woods don't scare me. A tick with Lyme disease might, though, right? Uh. Yep. Uh, oh, excuse me. The mic that needed that. Oh well. Yeah. So yeah, I expect you to be on my live tomorrow. Unless you're door dashing. You door dash? Oh shit. What time are you going live? Uh when that bitch opens, um probably like I don't know. Restaurants like that probably open at 11, I think. I think all restaurants open at 11, well, Eastern Standard Time. So for you, it'd be like, it'd be like 10, 10 for you, I think. Houston, Texas? Yeah. I think it's I, 10. I could pop up yeah. on you around like 10, man. See what Taco Tuesday they talking about, man. <laughs> Book, yeah, I'll be back. What? He said he'll be back. I'll be back. Oh, all right, all right. Oh, shit, there's comments. I ain't even read this shit. Wait, what? Oh, uh, let's see. <laughs> Why are the people here for Square? Yeah, that happens sometimes. I'm pretty sure only like five people are here for me. You know my yeah. class is like, what, five, maybe seven people in there. Damn, I thought Nina was nice to me. She Nina said I look like Forrest Gump and shit. God damn, I thought she was just... Well, Books, I'll tell you what, Books, I just happened to hear that before I took my earphone out. I'll tell you what I should do. I should start coming on in here, like, before I go do something and act like I'm going to be here. And then I just fucking tell you, you know, hey, I'm taking off to go do that. Just leave me up there. Get you some views, man. I appreciate that shit, but Square, a pretty rough crowd follow you, man, and they might get bored and start sending that shit my way. Not to say I don't want no parts of it. Like, you can come over here, bro. I ain't tripping, but I don't know if I want your subscribers like subscribing to me, I man. I started to say, if up. they do that, if they, well, hold on. They already fuck, started fucking with you even before I came over here, but if, if they started doing that, man, uh, you know, they don't want me to leave. They, they really don't. They can say they do, but but just imagine if I left, bro. Hey, hey I'm entertaining hey, too, hey, Square. Hey. Fuck you. <laughs> Go ahead. Hey, I, I know y'all entertain. I don't try to be entertaining these people. They fucking hooked on to me like a fucking dude that can't let go of a damn relationship that's over. Oh, uh, that's mean, true. Too. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, no, I, I'm fucking with you, man. You're good. I'll be back. All right. I mean, it is. I mean, it is what it is. Yeah. There he goes. First goal. <sighs> like, damn, like, really I, I, when I, I'll, I'll say this. When, when I dealt with my first breakup, I mean, you know, damn. I mean, I get it. But come on, man. Rejection's hard for him. Apparently so. Yes. You don't want them no more, Square? You keep telling them to leave you alone and not taking the hint or whatever. Crazy. Yeah, they, they make it seem like they make it seem like I gotta leave this motherfucker to be left alone. That ain't how it works. That's not how it works. Not at I'll all. I'll tell you what, Books. I, I, I'm gonna come over, Books, and live with you. And when you tell me to leave and leave you alone, I'm just gonna say no. <laughs> See how that works. <laughs> Maybe they've grown attached to you, Square. Maybe they're hooked on you, man. Maybe you're like them. <laughs> they're like lifeline. Their reason to live, if you will. Who knows? Yeah. 
is what it is. Shouts out to Rusey for sponsoring the show, sponsoring Stream Yards. Shouts out for CBD. Yeah, I know. CBD for getting me yeah, lit. Shouts out to Square <laughs> Troll. What did you say, Square? They, they, they thinking like I gave you some fucking money or some shit. They're down there. They said a comment. Well, I'll go ahead like, yeah, Rusey and Books have paid, or Rusey and Ian paid Books for friendship. I'm like, I ain't sending Books no money. They know something I don't. Books, you take my money? Not today, Square. Maybe tomorrow. <laughs> no. <laughs> I don't know what the people talk about. Probably just trying to, you know, stir that old shit pot like they love to do. Yeah, now they're going to demand that you show your cash app to prove <laughs> No, but I for real didn't send him books no money today. I guess Ruski did. Ruru. <laughs> Ruru the man. Yeah, Ruski, can, <coughs> Ruski can do what he want to with his money. <laughs> Ruru been running numbers or something, man, and one of them hit because shit. You know, he's just living his life now, bro. I support him, bro. You know what I'm saying? Anybody talking shit about Ruru, you might as well just talk shit about me, basically. That's how I feel about the issue. I, I never got why they started fucking with Ruski. I mean, I get, in a way, why they started fucking around with me. I was over there looking at Johnny and around all that shit. But, like, where the fuck they get Ruski from? Like, what the fuck he do? Who knows, man? Ruski, do you know why, bro? Yeah, because he has them awesome shower streams. I guess I'm not gonna say one again. Um, I, I've talked about that story uh, to to death. Oh, you death. don't have to talk about. I'm just saying in general. Yeah, you ain't gotta. Yeah, no, no, no. no I, I know. Yes. Oh, okay. He probably was hanging out with Andrea. No offense. I mean, I, right. I ain't that, got nothing against so let's not let's not go there, please. Not, we're not doing that. My bad. My, my <laughs> bad. My bad. My bad. I didn't. Hey, I don't know anything that's going on. I really don't. Everybody thinks I do, but I don't. You know what I'm saying? All right. All right. <laughs> Take it easy on that thing, Ruru, man. Remember to breathe. Yep. Oh, God. Yeah, I'm stuck. Oh, shit. I'm high. <laughs> Two Did you more say minutes, you smoking bro. mushrooms? You said you're vaping mushroom? Mushroom flavor. Mushroom flavored nicotine. There's mushroom extract in it. There's mushroom extract in, in the... Uh, oh, oh, okay. Yeah. I mean, it's not as it's not as good as I thought it was going to be. It, you know, you're, it's not really... You don't see... Uh, it's, not, it's not psychedelic enough for me. Yeah, I got the... I got to eat some mushrooms one time. I think I said something to the effect of creation is speeding up. Whatever the fuck that means. Uh, yeah, I don't. Yeah, what? Oh, Brownie, I'm sorry. Watch out, buddy. I don't mean to say I didn't I almost stepped on you.
this is the best way to get watch time hours. I don't want them like this, though, bro. I don't want troll watch time hours, bro. It always come back to bite you in the butt. The same person giving you the watch hours is the same person that heard you when you turned on your PlayStation or when you played that fucking Stevie Wonder song. And that's going to be the same fuck the copyright strike you and get your shit demonetized. I do not want these people anywhere around me. You know what I'm saying? They just happen to be here, and I'm just here. But I don't want them here. I, I make that very clear. Damn near everybody in this chat, probably self for Nina. Y'all should, y'all, I mean, if y'all just fucking love, I wouldn't give a damn, but they not bro, they assholes. Yeah, what that is. Yeah, pieces of shit on me. What have I been into, Nina? Not a goddamn thing. I'm innocent. Appreciate it, Casey. You know what I'm saying? I got 500 subs, you know. It's all right. You know, it's, it's not like I ain't been. I already did that shit, but you know. Second go round. It is what it is. Didn't need the damn work verse or turds or whoever. Get that shit on my own. You know what I'm saying? These people think they so fucking funny with their little high highs in the chat, man. They will probably never say no shit like that ever. I dropped the link. Why don't you get up here since you so funny, dude, and tell us your little, your little funny little quips, man. You all quipped out down there. Present your jokes orally, you little bitch. Click the link. If you're scared, I'm going to get off in a couple minutes anyways. I'm just going to smoke a couple more. Then I'm going to leave. Yeah. Yeah. What up, Lost Rebel? Yeah, Rebel down there, bro. Instead of like saying like, hey, man, you got 500 subs, that's what's up. You got some whole ass motherfucker. You only have 200 trolls. And man, shut the fuck up, man. Yo, nobody give a fuck about you, man. That's your problem. You try to make people give a fuck about you. And it, bro, I, nobody cares what you say. It's just annoying. Bro, you like a little mosquito, bro. You're not really making no noise. You just a little buzzing around, being a pest, bro. Pests aren't a factor, bro. You're not a, your little troll account with your little funny little period. That don't factor in the shit. I can really put your stupid ass in the fucking netherworld right now. Couldn't I? You couldn't do a damn thing about it. Go and make another troll account. Or give up. Extra lame out. This shit crazy, dog. Ooh. Zoned out there for a little while. Holy shit.
See, that's what y'all gotta deal with on y'all streams. There's people in the chat talking shit. You can barely get a motherfucking thought out without some asshole in the chat flipping it and trying to make you the worst person in the world. That's why this community, that whole community suck ass cheeks, bro. That's all y'all do. That shit so played out, bro. Shit, the, the shit really and truly, bro, played out, bro. Oh, locale, ho, oh, ho, make clips of them, ho, oh, oh, ho, oh. ho. Like, come on, this shit played out, bro. Do something different, bro. I don't know what to say to these people. All right, Bill, come out the sounds out out of here. I gotta go. I gotta do something. Uh, All right, man. Walk through the woods, man. Don't let the woods walk through you, bro. <laughs> Uh, you'll see me tomorrow. Tomorrow's my day off. I seriously am going to go to Hooters for Taco Tuesday. So, uh, you know, I'm going to send you a link tomorrow. Uh, Square wants it. I'll send it to him, too. I mean, I don't even know how to get a hold of him. You send it to him. You know, I don't know yeah. how to get a hold of Square. I'm either. All right. Whatever. All right. Uh, all right. I'll see y'all later. Bye. Peace, peace. Ruski, y'all. He just came through to say what's up, man. Show some support to, you know what I'm saying, a fellow YouTuber, man. Do some unhater shit that y'all can't never seem to do. Man. I don't ever speak on all of y'all like that, but quit using that time up. Stop playing. The fuck up, man. Golly. All right, you fine, man. You got my little face down there making high high judo chop. Shut the fuck up, man. See how easy it is just to just sit y'all down for 300 something, what it is, seconds? What you gonna do now? Who we, we got to you. We, we made you press a button. Oh, oh, no. Fuck on out my shit, man. That weirdo ass shit. Find something better to do with your time, man. For real. Shit, sad, man. 24 hours in a day, man. Get me doing something. Something, man. Books. Books. He is still there? Yeah. My bad, y'all. The hell happened to Ruski? He just said, "Yeah, they gonna do something." They just left. Talk to these people, Scott. These what? These people got a whole bunch of questions for you and shit. Man, fuck them motherfuckers, man. I'm telling you, like that Andrea Pete Luck in all capital letters. Get that bitch. Get, get that motherfucker up out of here. You know, I, I don't know how you feel about Andrea, but Andrea just wants to be left alone, like I do. We just want to be left alone, you son of a bitches. We just won't be left alone. I mean, they're making enemies all over the fucking place. Like, you know, it, it's only going to be not too much longer now. Before all the fucking cards are laid out on the table. Man, books, I ain't gonna sit here and monologue by myself. Where the fuck you at? I'm just sitting there chilling, man. Doing my evening. Man, I ain't fucking book. I ain't sucking books with stock, you stupid, ignorant motherfucker. I'm over here because it's bored. I'm bored. Hell, it's nice to come over here and talk to somebody for a change. Somebody actually wants to talk and talk about dumb shit. Hell, we can't ever talk about nothing else because you all motherfuckers fill up the chat. Mm. You know what mm. they're mad about? 
they're mad that. about because today's, today's my first day without any Adivan. I hadn't uh -huh. taken no Adivan today. That's yeah, what they're mad about. The day, huh? That's what I'm I'm drop, I've been tapering. I don't know if you've been around or listening, but. Mm -hmm. Nah, not, not necessarily. <laughs> I didn't think so. Uh, tapering is when a doctor helps you come off of something you've been on for a long time. Oh, does it? That's what that means. Yeah. How are you feeling since you've been tapering off your <clears throat> medication? It it's, not, it, it's not been easy. I mean, I've had some mm. nights sweating and withdrawal symptoms and all that, but not as bad because I've been dropping a little bit of the dose at a time. And when I got to the doctors, I was only at one. I was already down to one pill a day. So didn't have that much to go. Are you following up with something, some type of therapy, hobby, something to fill the void? Yeah, 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 yeah. I also got a... Well, I mean, not only am I doing, I've been doing therapy, but I got, uh, you know, just in case if uh, I actually have a few um, dosages that I could, you know, if the symptoms were horrible, but I haven't felt that bad of symptoms, so I probably won't even use the rest of these if I don't get sick. Okay. Well, I don't know why Kayla. I don't. I don't know why. I don't know why Kayla would say some shit like that. But I. I got to imagine it had to do with the big fucking paycheck the working verse cut her, and then she didn't mm. even do what she's supposed to do with it, which is get the fucking divorce so I can sign the damn thing. Okay. I can look. Low key, I think the bitch is still fucking staying married to me almost like hoping that I'm gonna fucking kill over and she's gonna get left something. All right. That's how you feel that way, man. That's how I mean shit. Why else do you stay married with somebody for this long? When you ain't even uh, with them. And your guess is as good as anybody's, I suppose. Uh you got a phone call. Hello. No RBR disrespect will be tolerated in my chat. Yeah, no, no racist neo Nazi references to elderly black gentlemen will be allowed in my chat. Take that shit somewhere else. Back to hell where you belong. If I get pissed off enough to say, pissed up off enough to say that, but just take it somewhere else, man. I can't even get it up. What up, Jen? Jen, what up? These people that have trip. That's what they do, though. Talk about people that ain't even here in the most deplorable of fashions. Man, you would think these people just live and breathe hatred 24 7. The shit they saying, these goddamn chat rooms, bro. And look at this dude right here, bro. What is your problem, man? What is this dude banning this user? What is my problem, man? You said unban the spooky, and I just put you on permanent ban. And I show you how I feel about that. Get out of my chat room, little boy. Go find you something to do on here, man. You're getting on my fucking nerves with this little shit y'all doing. Go somewhere, man. Y'all smell like outside. 
fuck up. Then we gonna start doing do a permanent vans on them. Permanently, man. You gotta call it back after that one. I have a white man, please give me greetings, urban youth. People don't talk like that, but but you don't walk up somebody and greet them with a hello, urban youth. What is it, what even what even is that? What's an urban youth? Just put two words together. Trying to be racist. Going out of your way to be racist. Extra clown ass up out there, man. Some of y'all probably was like bullied. Probably but like the people of your own race. But some type of way you deflected it off on like black people, some type of way. I refuse to believe that all this black joke and black it's like y'all probably don't even know black people in real life. That's the sad part. And y'all don't even I just do stupid shit because y'all done. Dub it pathetic. The pieces of shit. Dumb, stupid, lazy pieces of shit. I'm done with that. What you said, Jen? I don't know what's wrong with these people. How Brownie had not seen he brown. I don't even make sense. Brian on the bar said blacks and Jews. Come on, man. You feel good about yourself saying shit like this? Putting Brownie on the SS uniform? Come on, bro. <laughs> man, you little stormtrooper. You feel good about yourself, man? That's pathetic, bro. Dogs can't be racist, bro. I think I seen a racist turtle one time. But I don't think dogs can be racist. It's the people that train them. Now that's the racist motherfucker. I think dogs respond positively to anybody that gives them food and shelter. That's their whole thing. You know what I'm saying? Not playing the downfall of racial minorities on their spare time or what have you. I don't I don't think that's what dogs are doing. I tell you what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna permanently ban you forever. Your racist, hateful ways. And on the Bush from Moses YouTube channel, baby, we make a firm stand against racism and all the faces that it may take. We don't allow it. We don't allow that bullshit to motherfucking float. Oh, okay, I'm back. I take that, that phone call, Grant. My granddad. Well, they died off. Squirrel was on a phone call. Oh, the phone, bitch! Look at the video. It was it was fucking muted the whole time. For it for life. Kiss my ass. Murdered. Yeah, oh, sir. Wait, hold on. Hell no. Get that Kayla account out of here and get that Trump Monday square punch Kayla in the back of the head. That's a fucking lie. You got them fucking names rearranged the wrong way. Kayla punch square in the back of the head. I don't even see that shit. What do you see? I see. It's a little bit back. My, my fucking chat was scrolled up, I guess. So somebody say you punch I, I, It's true. All true. Well, show me the police report, motherfucker. Because until then, it's my word against hers. How about that? And I fucking put the story out first. Said it months and months and months and months before y'all even was able to get Kayla on this motherfucker. So kiss my ass.
Lord of mercy, Jesus. There was an eyewitness. Well, who? I know there was more than one eyewitness. So you're telling me I heard a woman in front of not one eyewitness, but two, three, four, at least three fucking eyewitnesses. And I just magically just, you know, oh, there goes that square. He's at it again. Just let it go. Uh, you said it was three eyewitnesses. Some Mexican, some, some, some Mexican know, dude. We, we, li we, we lived with my fucking uh, Muhammad's fucking girlfriend's parents. Try okay. a white girl and two parents, motherfucker. Ain't no Mexican dude there. You get you ain't got your facts, Bubba. There's a matter dude there, Bubba. No, it was some uh West Asian dudes there. You don't got your facts. Just out the Moabi, man. I'm surprised they didn't try to come out and say fucking something else. <laughs> that's racist. What do you mean that's racist? I just said there wasn't no Mexican dude there. I didn't say there couldn't be no Mexican dudes there. Stupid fuck. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. There could be Mexican dudes anywhere or a Mexican lady. You know what I'm saying? Matter of fact, I dated a Mexican. Are you fucking piece of shit? Yeah, I just thought. Mm -hmm. Fucking Gracie. Yeah, she was fucking, she had Cuban at, well, you know, Spanish descent, whatever. It don't matter. I think they call Caribbean it all race. Swear they didn't beat up a woman in front of a Mexican dude. Y'all cut out the malarkey. I don't even, that just sound made up. When you even say that's it out loud. Up. That's fucked up to say like I would do that. What are you trying to say? Maybe you're the one that's racist. What are you trying to say? Mexicans don't take up for women? See mm -hmm. how I can turn that around back on you, motherfucker? Because the way you tell it, shit, it's like fucking Jose was sitting there watching. He said, no way, Holmes, I'm not getting into this. Come on, man. And a little hundred and thirty, little hundred. I was hundred and thirty pounds then. Yeah, I'm sure fucking a dude would have just watched me do some shit like that and just not intervened. Like Somebody he's too big. Was, it was three with it was three eyewitnesses already on the seat. Said nothing went down. It's an argument. Heated argument, man. So foul. I mean, the most dumbest thing they could do, having my not yet divorced, fucking separated, cheating, didn't have that good of a character when I met her. I don't know what her character's like today, but. Well, if coming on the internet and telling lies for money is into any indication of it, it ain't too fucking good. Uh oh. But uh, they gonna have her fucking slander, tell a false story, and then tell her, "Oh, here, take this money and go divorce him." <laughs> like hell, I might end up suing her. That's like, nice. Judge, I, I, I wonder how to look in front of a judge and jury. Hey, Judge, I separate from this one. We've been separated now for a decade. And I start off getting heckled by these random no-name motherfuckers that don't know me. They look into my life. They find out I was married to this girl. They get her up there. They pay her money. And she tells a story that I somehow, like, beat her in front of witnesses 10 years ago. You know, just to ruin my character. All in the bid for money, Judge. If that's not slander, what is? I mean, she has no proof, no police report, no eyewitness to back up her, her testimony from that long ago. Plus, if it happened, why well, didn't it get reported or anything done about it? And also, to answer the fact, why the fuck did she then call me a week and a half later? to come pick her up 
and I went back to Nashville, picked her up, and brought her back to her mom's house. Tell me how that fucking makes logistical sense. I rest my case. I rolled her arm up in the window. What? Dude, that shit hurts. I did that shit to mine one time on accident. You know, just got it caught just barely. Hell no. The only thing I did, which I didn't mean to do, was her dog ran through the door and we were supposed to keep him in, in this room. And I closed the dog and I did break her dog's leg. Damn. I, I, I didn't mean to. But, or it, maybe it didn't break it, but it sprung it. I don't know. Um, you know, he, he, we took him immediately to the vet and, and, and he was okay. But yeah, I, mm -hmm. I broke his fucking leg. I didn't mean to. I mean, I, all I did was trying to close the door before he ran out. And, uh, Kayla got in front of me. And when she got in front of me, you know, I, I'm guessing he would, just had his, his eyes focused on her. And so he tried to get up around me. And as I got in, tried to get through and close the door, it caught, caught on his leg. Um, right. Yeah, I felt like a piece of shit. Sound, sound like, like a, you know, accident. Sound like, a, you know, it was an accident. It really was. <laughs> Maybe uh maybe you and Kayla can take your old case to Judge Gene over there and he might give y'all a fair and honorable ruling or whatever. You know what I am so glad this is being said on the internet. <laughs> oh, okay. Whatever. All I did was just say that I accidentally I mean she was there. I mean, why didn't she tell y'all that story? I mean if it, if if you don't think it was an accident, hmm, I wonder why didn't she tell you? Oh, maybe because it was. She was right there. She saw me. She saw it all happen right before her fucking eyes. That's the last thing you want to tell people about how you broke your dog leg. You know what I'm saying? Whether you did it or whether you was just around when it happened or whatever. I wouldn't want to tell. Anybody I did. That. I didn't even have to thank you for explaining this. I okay, whatever. Scared I'd do the same to her if she told it. Scared I'd what, dude? What? Now see they're they're trying to get my mind messed up. Because the dog thing happened in a completely different location and everything. And they're trying to almost like get the two things together. Like, I see what y'all are doing, but that's, that, that's no dice. It don't work like that. Better the dog's leg than, wow, okay. All right. How about better than no one's leg? Because that that would have been better. I mean, I I would have felt a whole lot better about myself if I, if that had never happened with the dog. I mean, it sounds like an accident, man. You know. See how you're trying to go the two things that didn't happen. No, ain't no one ever set up on this panel that her argument and her hitting me in the back of the head. Well, what what led from the argument never happened. No one never said that happened. And I disagreed vehemently with the lie that Trump Lamonde up there told about the specifics of it. But no, don't don't no, don't even try to do that. Mm -hmm. No, I told you that Kayla went through the door before me and the dog was following behind both of us. And I shut the door behind me and he's a really small little Pomeranian and he came around through the crack because he knows when he, he's used to us closing the door and keeping him in there because they didn't want him in the rest of the house. And so when I closed the door, 
I did not look down to make sure he wasn't halfway through. He was halfway through and leg back, and it got closed into the door. There you go. You know what vehemently means, and that is not how you spell it. You got it straight. I'm not, I'm done talking about my ex. Books, you fucking little motherfucker. You, did you get a cash app to set this up? Nah, man. Yeah, I mean, I would just ignore the chat if I was you. They've been doing the same thing to Ruski and me, bro, if you haven't noticed. Talking shit. I'm done talking about them. Talking t uh, about it to them fuckers. I don't even know. That's the thing. You motherfuckers are talking to me, and you can't even talk to me face to face. You got to stand down there in your alts. Well, books, you probably got all their mains blocked, don't you? I only got like probably about five people blocked me. I've been dropping the link the whole time. They just some pussies, man. Don't give them no credit. Don't give them no out, squeezy. They ass ain't blocked. They just, they just pussy poppers in the chat, man. Plain and simple. Wait, they pussy poppin'? Seats, grandmas and shit, man. That's crazy. Let me block this dude. That's crazy. We ain't trying to promote none of that shit over here, bro. Get on with that shit. <laughs> they said, yeah, you hear that? You're just pussy poppers in the chat. Come on now, books. Don't. Don't call them pussy poppers. And I would say, you know, give Kayla some slack too. I know that might sound crazy, but I don't think she's trying to wait till you die to get some money from you, thug. Maybe, you know. Dude, I, 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 she's look, just a look, heavy look, procrastinator look, or I, some shit, you know. I just said, no, she, she probably done the same thing I did. Well, you know, he paid for it. I paid. You know, she the one left me out like well, you pay for. It. You know, it's one of them cases. Okay, yeah, yup. See, that make a lot of sense. I don't think yeah, she ain't trying to wait till you die, man. That's you know what I'm saying. Come on now. Nah. Yeah, you keep thinking that, bub. You keep trying to think like you can count my pockets. I will say, Square, I don't want to say this to try to jinx you, you know, knock on wood, but don't let this YouTube shit, you know what I'm saying, fuck up your taper effect, man, and, you know, fuck up your forward progression, man, you know, I wouldn't say turn it off as they winning, but, you know, you keeping your peace sort of a thing, keep your roll going, don't let them fuck up your rocking and rolling over there, you know what I'm saying, sounds like you're doing good, you know what I'm saying, keep that momentum. Yeah, they're trying to get to me. They think like I actually. <clears throat> they think I actually still tell them like that shit right there. Three. Yeah. Well, you can assume. All right. Just because I tell you that, you think that's exactly what I got. Because I don't ever come on here and tell y'all any bullshit. For you, time up. Put three hundred in a very three hundred seconds, motherfucker. I said that the other day. And see, they, they they try to say stuff like that. Like they'll they'll report everything I say and be like, "Oh, you said this, you said this, you said this," but they'll forget that I also said this, 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 and that because it don't fit their narrative. Oh no! I think any cuss word used in a live stream means you can get demonetized. So it's just I don't know. YouTube do got these crazy ass rules that people do take advantage of, but it's like the rules are there. So. I don't know, man. Shit is what it is. This will be the last time I will address this, and it goes to the YouTube watcher fucking commenters uh, statement. I do not abuse women, animals, or the elderly. My name is Square on YouTube, otherwise known as Ian Jagger Wilson, and I do not. And you worky turds, a.k.a. the gang-stalking activities of the worky-verse, 
does all this shit and questions all this shit and any stories ever told all for their own amusement and to profit off of, which is illegal. Oh, yeah, you're right. It don't take much to piss me off usually. It's crazy, man. With these many people just trying to pop. So, I, I'm not trying to be any type of way, but are you not on the Gene team no more? Nah, man. I'm a long wolf now. Hey, me too. How you like it? Uh, it's cool, you know what I'm saying? Really, I just been staying away from people tag me and shit, trying to, you know, grind my gears. But it's been cool, you know what I'm saying? I just been staying away from shit, you know. I stay away from everybody. The Jenny team, the worky turds, the little shits, the mushrooms. Hey, you know something? I with model fucks if I can. If I can help it, I mean. I saw something that solidifies that bird is still cool with them people you want this is a conspiracy or this is like a cold hard fact or you want to lay down right here because if it's a conspiracy cool just preface it by saying hey this is what i think this isn't necessarily true let's put it this way. a video a video a video i seen that had a comment from her sector was commented on and I just can't think that anybody that's supposed to be cool with them would like or would appreciate the fact that they're see what they do they have these little unlist they got unlisted videos that you can't just go and find and uh so if you don't have the link, you can't pull it up. And they only give the link out to, you know, they, they, they're they they're starting to change their tactics up more. I mean, you said all that to say. There is people, I mean, I, I'm saying all that to say, I, I think Bird is, is still cool people from like I, I i'm saying i i don't know if what you're saying is so wrong i mean but square just humor me for a second wouldn't that also suggest that you're cool with people from the working verse because if you have to have this unlisted video link that bird or whoever sent it out and you happen to have it don't that mean both y'all cool with the with the working it was shared in a, it, it was shared in the chat over there they they, oh. they share it in the chats and stuff yeah, so it's not like it's completely, you know, but but it's not. It's obscured for a reason. Uh, uh huh. I don't know. Otherwise, why would they? Because they say they never take anything down, but this is something that's been privated or unlisted, so it has the appearance that it's not a. Well, they might, I mean, it might take more than an unlisted video, buddy, but if you can come with something else, and you can prove it. If I, I mean, if I, 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 here's why the argument, me being a part of them, is really ridiculous. Because there hasn't nobody had, I mean, who else do you see? Part of all the people that filthy supposedly trolls, and I'm not saying he don't do fucked up shit to everybody on there, including me. But who else do you see that he fucks with the most? You hear them; they're all on square, 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 square. Like they, <laughs> there's just no way, man. That they, they couldn't pay me enough to to go through all that shit. There's no way. Okay. I mean, that does make sense, man. You know, I heard him say some pretty foul shit to you, so 
I get what you. I, I, I mean, look at all the stuff that they have out on me. Look at all the lives I went through and defending myself and going through stuff or falling for their tricks, the fucking peace and different things. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Xbox, you're Xbox, you're right, but when it's when it involves, you know. I say it's it's fucking gotten bigger over time, and the more people they have added to it, it's I think like I, I guarantee you that we're being sniped right now, but we're not being sniped anywhere, man. You can find it, mm, and 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 they've been. And they've been doing this shit just recently. And they're having weirdo watch parties. <laughs> That's creepy. That's some creepazoid shit. Just see, if I do an unlisted live and I say, all right, I'm going to snipe books now. Everybody in the chat, don't nobody let anyone know else where this is going on. I mean... Maybe, maybe not. Who knows? Mm-hmm. Well, I ain't with that whole, if you can't beat them, join them shit. And I ain't trying to wrestle around in the mud with no goddamn pig. So eventually, if I just keep walking down this little YouTube street or whatever, they'll become a distant memory. So I ain't worried about it. Either way it goes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I really had this do. Dude coming here making these empty threats. I ain't even coming. Yeah, they got. Me hanging up over here is not engaging. Yeah, here we go with the trolling the worky verse coming in here with his bullshit. Uh, that's Troll of the Worry Verse. What he always, oh, he was on KC shit the other day. Yeah, and you notice how he talked? He's like, you know, he basically was a revit. He, he admitted to me that he'd been trolling me and everybody. You know, you know I ain't just troll the Worry Verse. And he's a liar. He said he's going to leave you too when he back on it. That's a lie. Exactly. But I thought only Square did that. Well, you're not alone, buddy. But he he did it and planned it, though. I I, I didn't ever do it and plan it at the last time. So. According to them. And all they know. Which is good to remind everybody of the disclaimer that this stream and everything said on my end, I can speak for me, has been for entertainment, informational, and educational purposes only. Nothing said was fact and only statement and or fantasy for entertainment. Thank you very much.
Yep, yep, yep. Ditto. Yeah, Good. I don't need to read the chat. You're right. Oh, boy. Yeah, that's what they do it all is for a reaction. So I wondered if I just played videos constantly, if they'd get fucking bored with that eventually. Because people, I don't know. I guess I got to get off YouTube for a year and come back and I'll be good. By that time, <laughs> they'll fucking move on to somebody else. Do more Squizzy Potter content, man. Come on, bro. That's what you need to be doing out there. That's what the streets is missing. That's what I do. If I was you. I don't know. It's just a thought, you know. Yep, yep. No, not yet, Marty. It looks expensive, man. I think the XD was that. The XDS is around like 400. The XD9s are like five, and the XDMs are like five thirty, six hundred bucks. I haven't had a chance to shoot one of those bad boys. I don't know nobody that got one. If they do that, haven't told me they got one. I'm going to get the BRG. It's like the next best thing. It's a clone or whatever. I'm going to get that. I don't know, man. They said them SIG got a pretty bad rep of them having negligent disc fires a lot with them SIGs. I don't know if it's specifically to what the P365, but they said one of them SIGs, man, they fucking, you bump into that motherfucker too much and it goes off and shit. Hmm. Yeah, them Hellcats is nice, though. I ain't gonna lie. I like grip safeties, though. That extra safety feature. Oh, you said that's the uh, P320? Yeah, I knew it was one of them motherfuckers. Some guy was talking about, hell to the fuck? No, I got to get rid of that bitch. I think he had it for like, I don't know, maybe like a couple of months or whatever. He was at the range. It just went off all willy-nilly. He sold it within that week. And he bought another Glock or something. I don't know. Well, books, I'm going to know. I think I'm gonna jump off since they uh they just fucking man they just piss me off. Oh, that's the cool being you squirm. Man. I appreciate you being up here, bro. Anytime, man. You take it easy, bro. They saying I'm making the whole stream about me and shit. I ain't trying to do that. That's what they fucking do. And they get me going and they blame me. That's what they always fucking do. I, I, keep I, your mouth I, shut and not say shit to me. I wouldn't say shit. I don't feel that way at all, Square, you know, so. But if yeah, people are saying it, that don't necessarily make it true, make it true. So you got to learn how to ignore things. I get it. Shit, man. Guess I just start ignoring everything. Fuck, I don't know. Damn. I don't know. I guess you know. Block the motherfuckers like I do. I'm shifting gears on my channel, switching it to different shit. Shit that they not interested in. Hopefully they motherfuckers just go away. Like the whole distant memory thing I was talking about a few few minutes ago. I don't know, man. Just put some time on it, man. I know you like books. That's crazy. It's been a year and these motherfuckers still trolling. Yeah, I, I ain't, I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna I don't know. 
I ain't even gonna go live today. The way they, they, they talking this crazy shit. Hey man, just make a new page with they can't find the name and create shorts. You'll get subscribers like that, interaction like that. You know what I'm saying? It'll take a little minute, but it'll be worth it. Use a voice changer or something. I don't know. I'll try to stay a little bit longer, but they make me want to run off because they fucking. Well, I'm trying to keep focused. Uh, you know. You gotta stay focused out there, Squid, man. I be telling you all the time stay focused, man. And keep God and Jesus first, bro. Put that dude on permanent. Get the fuck out of here, Mo. Bada bam. Well, you said that new Red Dead Redemption came out, didn't it? Or what you were saying? You said yeah. Something. Jennifer said, "Hey, square." Jennifer. Jennifer said, hey, Jennifer. Is it, is it new? Or is it like a remake, like what they did with Grand Theft Auto, man? I think it's. Uh... I, I'm not exactly 100% sure. I think it's... Uh, no, they came out with uh, the... the re Well, Red Dead Redemption wasn't ever on... No, they just came out with the original Red Dead Redemption for PS4 and 5, I think. And, uh, and it came with a, a zombie, some, some kind of zombie game too, but it it was the Red Dead Redemption that they didn't have on PS yet, the first one. Oh, okay. Red Dead Revolver or some shit. Hmm. That'd be a cool artifact, you know. If it really was, Marty, I see what you're saying down there. Oh. Put that person on B lock mode. Get you some of that. I uh, think I might have something to share for you if you want to play. This shit's crazy. What is it? This uh, traffic stop. This dude. Pull that up. So is that the one where that dude had like the miners in the back seat and shit? Yeah. Yeah, I, I I heard of that, but I don't, you know, no offense, square, but I don't want to watch that shit. That shit was, dude. Oh my god, it was, it was fucking crazy. All right, I got you, but still, it was. I, I don't know if you've seen it or not. Yeah, I heard about it and shit, but yeah, that's. I'm glad that officer. He came. That dude he came. Him. He came. He came out the truck with his fucking zipper down. Yeah, I'm glad that man, whatever that officer was feeling, to just pull that dude over. Good job. Ah uh, no. I know, dude. Like, he had to think, man, ain't no talent, man. I don't know what I would have done if I was that cop. I probably would have been off the course. You know what I'm saying? Make him, eat, make him eat a little bit of that concrete for a second. You know what I'm saying? Our court cases might run together, or he might not have a court case. <laughs> I might. Motherfucker would scream, put down the weapon. Ain't no telling what he could have did then. Shit, I'm just saying. Yeah, 
Let's see what's going on. That's kind of crazy, man. Video I watched. I watched the video. Hold on. You ever thought about traveling out of the country, Squizzy? I don't think I've ever asked you that before. And if so, where would you go, Squid? Squid man going to Greece or some shit like this? Probably uh Amsterdam. Nah. Nice, nice. Okay, I see what you I see what you're getting getting at there. What were you fight what were you about to say though? Uh I, technic I said I just seen a video too uh of a cop tried to seduce this one fucking chick. It's fucking crazy. Ah. Uh. Oh, he tried to like, like get her a ticket like, and try like, to like, like hey, get out of this ticket like, by you know rubbing my Johnson or some weird shit like that. I don't know. It it uh it was titled uh, it, it was a bad cop uh and he had this girl pulled over and and I th I think he had he, he he she's in the car with him and he starts basically like what's your name you got a place like basically hinting that like he'll come back over and see her later and she's oh, 17. Oh yeah. oh yeah yeah had her in this cop car you know doing his job and then it's like where are you at you know huh. right there on camera that. too I'm making a motherfucker either. That dude got to get fired ASAP or you got to move out that city because, man, that, there's some weird shit going on over there. Fuck that. He literally says, quote, you're sexy. Is that unprofessional of me? I don't know. D'Angelo Rock. D'Angelo Rise. Hey, damn sure ain't give me your license and your registration. That's what I thought they were supposed to be saying out there. I thought that was the kind of the script to the whole deal. It is what it is out there, man. What you say, Jennifer, that happens where you live? Nah. That's fucked up when the police abuse their power like that. Especially towards women. I bet them women be feeling powerless, but the thing for cameras, you know, you just damn Jennifer. I'm good. sorry. Yeah, that is fucked up. You know, another case uh, that's real messed up is the Daniel Holt Claw case. Daniel Holt's Claw. He had, I don't know, he got 200 and something years for pulling over these women. And oh my God, it was horrible. Yeah. 200 and something years, man. He probably deserved it, man. And, si and sister is trying to, like, still say that he's innocent. Well, I'm sorry, but you don't have that many. It's just, man, I mean, it's not like he was famous or anything. He's a cop, you know? You just don't have that many people saying that something happened and didn't. Uh, just, I, I don't think so. Hell, I could be wrong. Oh, no. Yeah, I think I'm finna get off this shit, Bill Square. I'm finna probably sit back, relax, and get something to eat real quick, man. I appreciate you being up here, though, bro. Uh, no, nah, biscuits aren't a soft spot. You know, funny funny thing you mentioned, that guy that, that, that threw those biscuits at me who lived on my street, 
the kid around my same age, well, he's about a year older than me. Turned out later on, he actually, uh, they had fucking, he got busted and sent to jail for meth and shit, manufacturing and, you know, possession of meth. So I, I'm actually quite pleased uh, with the trajectory of our lives, how they turned out. That's why everybody keep talking about biscuits and swear somebody threw a can of biscuits at your ass. Like the one, yeah, I to told them that, and they didn't beat me up. They fucking fired some bottle rockets and they and they threw a bit and he squat threw a biscuit at me. Ooh, big fucking deal. Oh, it was already already cooked biscuit or like it's in the can. I just biscuit got man know. already and uh, I already made biscuit man like you know already made, okay, it already made. Now, imagine someone having a biscuit and throwing it yeah. at your face okay okay that's a, I ain't gonna lie that's hilarious but probably in that moment it was fucked up they were trying to like beat you up and harm you and shit but, I mean that's like some shit that happened on the TV show somebody get hit upside the head with a biscuit like, that, I don't know man that's that's crazy as a motherfucker. Shame on them, and these, Shame and, on them. And, and, the, and these people and, and dude, I've got fucking I've got l lingering shit from you know, I, I don't want to make it about me or nothing. That's what they'll fucking say. But basically they, they've heard all these stories where I, I had issues with bullying and stuff, and that's exactly what they do. They're playing on that. They they know that I had to deal with it all the time growing up and never like really got it resolved, you know. I mean, so, sometimes I'd get it resolved. Uh, one time I fucking need the shit out of this one kid. And I remember for about the rest of that month, almost, it seemed like, and nobody fucked with me right then. You know, that's what my dad used to always say. Oh, fuck them up. Gouge them in the eyes. Do this, do that. And they won't fuck with you no more. Shit, that only works for so long. You can only gouge so many people in the eyes, huh, Swizzy? Well, no, I never could do that. But, I mean, he fucking did say that to me one time. And I was like, damn. You know, but, but I think he was trying to get the cross to me. You know, like, fuck one of them up real good and they'll fucking leave you alone. I'm like, eh, it don't really work that way. I mean, I know you can't go back in time and, like, beat up the people that were trying to beat you up. But you ever thought, of taking some, you ever thought about taking some spare boxing classes at UFC? Like, bro, I did. Bro, Put, their, put somebody's yeah. face on his body and like do a sparring competition, not necessarily whoop ass, but you know what I'm saying? Man, Get your first I'm a brown, on. I'm a brown belt. I mean, oh, okay. I, I, I belt. mean, I, but I, I didn't get to the black, obviously. <laughs> mm. I quit. You might want to pick I it up, really man, and get and polish off my the dad, brown belt and get back out. My, my, my dad kind of pushed me into karate. I never did really, you know, it's something I did with my dad. It's like one of the, yeah, it's one of them type I mean, of things. You can be your own dad, bro. You're a grown man. You can get back into karate, bro. I say do it, bro. It might be good for you, man. Nah. You never know, Squeezy. Get you some discipline, some karate out there, some you know the the breathing, I couldn't, and the breathing and shit. I, I, All that shit. I could, I couldn't do uh, a bunch of the kicks and stuff. I, there's no way I could do them now. The way my leg is, I mean, I used to roundhouse kick and all that stuff. But see, you'll never be able to do it if you think you can't do it, man. So you gotta stop all that stupid thinking. It's thinking, thinking, man. Gotta, I turn it around, man. Now, Brownie, what are you doing? Oh. Well, hello there. What do you want? You only come around me when you, when you want a treat or something. Don't you? No, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Get out of here, Jay. Can't That's how somebody flagged your channel. Can't believe they, uh, oh, Marty, I, I, do stretch, I do do stretches and stuff every day. I, I don't know if you'd call it a hardcore workout, but 
there's a routine I do do every day. I, um, I try, well, I do it every single day, but I try to do it every day, especially when I wake up early. I'm telling you, Squirt, my homeboy, he used to have a bow flex. Man, them things that get you jacked. And it's really not like hardcore working out, bro, when you're on a bow flex. I mean, they're a little expensive or whatever, but them shits kick ass. You talking about like a talking about like a total gym type of thing? Like my I guess that's what yeah, they call them. We used to call them both whatever, but like the little basically it's not really weights, it's like a bar and arrow type pulling strings type setup. Them shits the shits. The Chuck Norris joints. They need to get you jacked. Yeah. Yeah. Mm hmm. Shit. Okay. Everybody, when I buy my PlayStation 5, I'm going to give y'all my game attack. You can all play the game. I don't even play my PlayStation 4 no more, really. Shit. As soon as I get that 5, I'll probably get back on the game and shit. KC do got a range, don't he? KC in here? Ah, oh, shit, this Ain't nobody blocking it. Oh damn, I'm on stream. I can't see. I don't think nobody. Let me see. I can't stroll up that far. It's been too many trolls coming. Can't you? Oh, ghost in this bitch. Be careful, square these Cyrus trolls here, these people. Oh, these are the people you don't want looking at you. Oh, shit. Books, do you really believe delivering pieces is more dangerous than being a police officer? In certain cities, in certain occasions, hell to the motherfucking year. But but police officers got uh body vests that they can press special buttons on, and all their homeboys come assist them. Bulletproof vests, uh service issued pistols that make your ass turn into dust. Uh they got the what are those boots that'll stop them up. They more prepared. You just man, you just out there with a pizza box and a hot bag and a hope and a dream. Yes, that, that would be more dangerous in certain situations, of course, you know. Everything has, you know, its own little nuance to it. Damn, piece of man can't call for bag up, that's all I'm saying. You your own bag up out there. I don't see Casey. Well, she coming again. I thought Casey had her. Anywho, I think I'm finna end this stream. Squid, did you have anything else you want to tell these people? You can get it out if you if you feel the need. That's Squid Man, aka Squizzy, aka Squiggly Lines. The new trolls know once and for all enough with the bullshit, turning a new leaf. And the taper effect is going down, baby. It's going down in a major way. I think Squirrel, 
Real proud of you, you know what I'm saying? I think Brownie might have took Brownie out for a walk or something. So I think it's a good enough time. Oh, yeah. And the square, you know what I'm saying? If you still there, peace out, bro. Appreciate you being on the panel. You know what I'm saying? Take it easy. Keep on rocking in the free world. Do your thing. Put God in Jesus first, bro. And keep on keeping on with your taper, bro. We believe in you. And you know what I'm saying? Believe in yourself. Just think you can do it and you'll probably achieve it, bro. Keep on striving to success. And that goes.